Hey guys and welcome to the Akinon's YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn how to measure elapsed time in Python. So let's get started. So Python offers us the time module. So let me just import it. And basically the time module allows us with extensive features with working with the time application, such as finding the current time. So we will be making use of the time library. And let me give you a simple demonstration of how we will measure time elapsed. So basically what we will do is we will start measuring the time at the beginning of the execution of the code. And after a certain part block of code is executed, we will stop the timing and then we'll subtract the time that took at the start to the time that took to the end. So it's as simple as that. So first thing is let me create a variable start that will store the time at the beginning of the execution of block of code. And that will be done using the time dot time function, which basically current measures the time at the current instance. And now I will make use of some function called as time dot sleep. And this function simply pauses the execution of the program at that current line for the amount of seconds specified. So I have specified here 10 seconds in the argument. So the time that will be paused of the execution of the code will be 10 seconds. And then I need to create another variable called as end and again measure the end time using the time dot time function. And all I need to do is now print the difference between end and start. And now if I do this, so as you can see, the execution is paused at the timing. There's nothing coming on the output window because I've used the time dot sleep function. And let's just wait for 10 seconds. And as you can see, we found the execution of this block of code from these set of lines to come as 10.008 seconds. So using the time library, we can extensively measure how much a certain block of code takes to execute in an approximate range of error. So that's it from this video guys. If you like this video, don't forget to drop a like and share it with your friends and subscribe to the Akinon's YouTube channel for more fun and interesting videos.